One of the big questions I get when it comes to pier fishing is how do I decide which side of the pier I'm going to fish on? And that's really gonna be heavily dependent on the time of year. The reason for that is most fish that are moving along the beach, especially the migratory pelagics like Spanish mackerel, king mackerel, and false albacore, what they're doing is moving north for the summer when it gets really warm, they're looking for colder waters, or they're moving south for the fall. Again, it's starting to get cold, so they're gonna look for warmer waters. So the reason that these seasonal movements of predators are gonna help me decide which side of the pier that I want to fish on is because I want those predators to have the maximum opportunity to see and strike my lure. So what's gonna happen if I'm fishing the wrong side of the pier is I'm gonna make that cast and as I'm retrieving it, those fish are going to be coming at it head on and they're gonna have a very small window to strike it. So in the spring, typically I'm gonna be facing the south side of the pier because those fish again are moving north. So I'm casting south, retrieving with those predator pods and essentially that's gonna allow mackerel to attack it, bluefish to attack it. And the footage you're seeing here is actually from the springtime when I was fishing the south facing side of my local pier and I had some really good success doing it. And now that the temperatures are changing to a little bit colder, those fish that were moving from the south to the north are now taking their migration south again. They're moving from north to south. So I've started facing the north side and fishing that north side of the pier. And I've been having good success with that as well as you guys are seeing here with some mackerel that I caught recently. And this trend is going to continue through the winter Typically during the winter months, we don't have as much activity, but the fall and spring are really when there's a lot of fish that are on the move. And those are really my favorite times to be fishing on the pier. So I hope this was a quick and helpful answer for you guys. And it'll help give you guys some decisiveness on which side of the pier you're gonna be fishing on. But if you guys wanna get some more tips for pier fishing, as well as how to become a better inshore angler, I highly recommend you join us in the Salt Strong Insider Club, where we guarantee we're gonna help you catch more fish in less time and save you up to 20% on the best rods, reels, lures, all kinds of tackle like that with a 20% off discount for Salt Strong Insider. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thanks again for watching.